not get. Uh, it's getting the watermelon. Everybody get their poles. And it's probably out. Everyone's Somebody did say that they, they like. They <laughs> <laughs> that they like freaking that's, watermelon. That's the watermelon. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck. What the? Well, he's enjoying his watermelon. <laughs> Chilling. Looking cute. Like, oh, Just. Eating a watermelon. He smelled it, so... I was literally over there and it ran. And I was like, oh my god. Should we chase it off? Yeah, I think you should. Yeah. try. Yeah. I'll watch you do that. Go with poles. Oh my goodness. Hey, 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 hey. Nice. What the heck? Wow, look at that. Oh my god, he's like, even go that far. So look at him, he's still not wanting to go anywhere. <gasps> he doesn't care. Keep running at him. He won't put. Seriously. <laughs> he just comes back, look at it. It's still just staying there. He's like, I know there's a watermelon, everybody. Good morning, all day. Um, let's see, day 80. We already had an exciting morning. We had a visit from a bur black bear that's actually was brown looking and was just chilling, eating some watermelon. Um, anyways, had a cup of coffee. And we're about to head to McDonald's, get some breakfast, and um, just enjoy our zero day. For town chores, we have to do some laundry, and we have to get new shoes, which is exciting. So, gonna get that done today. And of course, also have to enjoy the internet and relax. And um, that is all. <laughs> we do. <laughs> I'm the guy in the middle. Yeah. <laughs> We are headed to McDonald's, Mickey D's, to get some cheesy. <laughs> yeah, okay, that's all about as far as I got. <laughs> I'm gonna get a uh, bacon sausage, sausage egg biscuit sandwich. Yum. Uh, I'm gonna get a sausage egg and cheese on uh, the sandwich. I'm just gonna go and just let what speaks to me. Ah, uh, yes. Speak to me. All the food. You're gonna channel yeah. the. Uh, Hiker hunger. The hi yeah, exactly. Yeah. Our call doesn't like us anymore. <laughs> okay, so we are on our third egg and cheese McMuffin. Right there, sandwich. Number three, and sausage. Number three, and a and cup of coffee. A nice big cup of coffee for only a dollar, thanks to Somewhere's advice of downloading the app. Excellent. And a thing of Dr. Pepper. And we oh still have God. another sandwich. So we're going to eat a total of four egg, cheese, sausage, McMuffin. Mm -hmm. Ain't even sorry about it. And a Coke, a Dr. Pepper, a coffee, and a water. And friends. I ate four too, and I'm already done. <laughs> so bird call helping me across the street. <laughs> What'd you say? I said luckily we brought the leash today. Alright, finished that Mickey D's. And we are headed to the outfitter store to see if they got shoes. Well the gear exchange did not have shoes, so we have to go across town. Um to a sports store or whatever. So we decided we're gonna go back to the campground, do some laundry, and then um, then we'll take the catch the bus downtown. Running across the street. <laughs> we wanted to um, do a shout uh, thank you. <laughs> we wanted to say a huge thank you to Paul who made a huge contribution to our PCT travels. And um, we just wanted to say thank you so much. Um, we are just blown away by your kindness and your generosity. And you're really gonna help us see us through to Canada. So thank you so much, Paul.
about to do some laundry and we got some Tide Pods in the hiker box, so that's exciting. Okay, I got my tractor, track, trash compactor bag full of dirty laundry. Roadrunner be coming with me. We're about to do um, some cleaning. So I mentioned this yesterday, but um, the race, there was a race, um, a 200 mile race around the Tahoe Rim Trail. And one of the volunteers brought, um, after the race was over, brought over all the, the leftover food from the aid stations. And also he said that a lot of people um, just leave their clothes there, like that they have at different aid stations and stuff. So we had a whole bunch of extra just hiker clothes or just clothes, you know, like runner's clothes. But so I got a, I got this shirt, which is awesome because it's just a laundry shirt so I don't have to walk around in my raincoat. But I scored these REI, let's see, co-op shorts. They've got the liner on the inside. And at first I thought they were like a little too big, but as I put them on, they're so soft and so comfortable. I feel like they might look a little baggy, but um, my elastic band was coming, kind of coming out on my last pair of shorts. So I think I might have scored a new pair. I mean, they feel new, they smell new. A new pair of REI runner shorts. <sighs> Trail provides. You can say, well, that, that guy was just over here. Mm -hmm. I think if you are going to Chesame, do that, go to Backpacker Country, pay the $8 the first time, or something, pay, you know? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. The other guys are, are Spending like hundred dollars to, to stay in the True. Yeah. For eight dollars. Thanks. <sighs> Yay, laundry's done. We are finished with that chore. So that's exciting. Now we get to go look at new shoes. I'm excited about that, but also that's gonna be a process. So that's definitely gonna take a hot minute because we gotta take the at least it's free, it's a free bus that they offer, and we gotta go down. I guess it's like downtown. Um, gotta go downtown. We gotta go by the water or something. Um, a little bit further from here, down to um, a bigger sports store, so we can find our shoes. Anyways, that's gonna be an adventure, and there's probably gonna be a burger and French fries and some ice cream along that as well. Okay, so we're about to go shoe shopping and I just wanted to give a little comparison so y'all understand what we're going through with these ultras. Want to show... Oh, hold on. Okay, so check out Roadrunner's shoe. Okay, look at that tread, people. She got it at the same exact time that we got our ultras. There's not even a single hole. Well, well what is okay. that? <laughs> that's, that's, that's unusual. I've never had that before. Yeah, that is unusual. But there's not a hole inside. That's right. just a little bit of rubber. Also, same thing, yeah, amazing, just amazing. <laughs> and then, now look at these. So look oh, at this, we got a hole, that's going all the way through, okay? What else we got? This one, definitely all the way through. Got a hole there, you just can't see through because we put the duct tape there. Look at this tread. tread. The tread is gone. It's sad. That is just gone, gone. I think, oh, that this side's about to blow. <gasps> same mileage. Same mileage. Same exact mileage. Yep. <laughs> so somewhere has topos and swears by them. Except for there's a couple of hikers over here by this table here. Two hikers that have topos. And one of them got him his in Kennedy Meadows and they busting through. They got a little hole, though the tread's pretty all right. And then the other guy got his in Bishop, which that's only like, not even a couple hundred miles from here. And he already has a serious hole in his shoe. So I'm thinking Solomon's are the way to go. All right, we're walking to the shoe store. Well, actually we're walking to the bus stop and then we'll go to the shoe store. There's an art supply store. I need to get some more water coming. Oh yeah. Okay, we made it off the bus and we are walking to Sports LTD. LTD? 
And uh, Bird Call just said he needs some watercolor paper, so hopefully we can find an art supply store around here. I think we can. Also, we're getting kind of hungry. I think I'm at like over 80 paintings so far. Wow, over 80? Yeah, my, on my next set of watercolor paper, I'll probably break 100 paintings. Oh my gosh. It's a painting machine. Okay. Am I the only one that whenever I see a Keep Tahoe Blue sticker that sees two people making out? I'm just saying. It looks like two people making out. She's gonna like it. It is swimming a little. Those are the men's eights. It's the eight and a half. I'm oh, okay. Right so, which kind of shoes you got on right now? I'm in the Solomon's. I don't even remember which ones these were. The Genesis. The Genesis. Oh, the beginning. Um, In the beginning, God made Solomon's. <laughs> Look at these bad boys. That's what I'm doing. The Genesis. Okay, go ahead and model them for me. Yeah, I got those guys to set me up for position liners and lock ones. Turn to the side. Yeah. Cool. Oh, so clean. Those are really cool looking. I <laughs> know. Got the five room. Yeah. Nice white toe cool. box. All right. Yeah. Trail names. Bird I'm, call. Go ahead. I'm Boss Bay. Boss Bay? Boss Bay. And I'm yeah. Bird Call. Bird call? Yes, sir. You guys were like brand new hikers. Bird call got a brand new hat. Well, not a new hat, but you found that new in the sunglasses. hiker box, right? Yep, hiker Ooh. box hat. Brand new sunglasses. Nice. They already feel much better in my eyes. And brand new. Brand new kicks. Kicks. This is his super cute. Um, this is my. These are my hiker clothes. box clothes. Yeah. We're gonna give them back though. But you look super cute in them. Second round of many Mickey D's. Boom. No shame. Well, we finished with our errands. It's been a long day. Headed back to the campground. Show them the pie we got. We got half a pie. We got an apple pie. So excited. And uh, let's see what side. Is it in this side? Mm, yeah. The other side. Bottle of yes. wine. Yes. We decided to get a little bottle of wine. We got some nice uh, sourdough bread with some brie cheese. Yes. After our dual meal extravaganza at McDonald's. And then we both got new shoes, as I was saying, and as you saw. But as we've been walking around today in my new shoes, I started to hurt my feet. So I don't know if they just had a lot of salt today and my feet are swollen and maybe that's why they hurt. Or more than likely, it's the brand new shoes that I got. My feet are like, uh-uh. Which I think is a good thing, considering we're still in town. But uh, it just... I don't know. Sucks. It just sucks. I'm tired. I was hoping that they were just going to feel amazing. They felt good when I left the store. And how do you like your new shoes? Mine feel great. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's yeah. how I know mine aren't good. Because he's like, they feel amazing. My feet feel great. And he said that uh, like three times today. And he says his toe is feeling a lot better. Or the top of his foot is feeling a lot better. So anyways, all right. No big deal. We are in town, there's not a crisis, and we're just gonna go back tomorrow morning before we head out. Easy peasy. Back to the shoe shop and try on a bunch of different other shoes and... There we go. Easy.